Are you looking for a way to create cover art for your podcast, but you don't have a lot of time or you don't have a lot of money? Today, I'm going to be showing you how to create podcast cover art in Canva using some of the most easy, simplest templates ever. So the first thing that you want to do is head over to canva.com. Once you're there, you want to go ahead and type in podcast cover art or podcast artwork. That'll bring you up with some amazing templates. Now, if you want to start from scratch, you're more than welcome. For the purpose of this tutorial, I just wanted to make this very easy on you for a first time, you know, podcast creator, designer, this isn't too advanced. So what we're going to do here is we're going to look at templates. As you can see, this is why I love Canva. They have tons of amazing templates and we're going to find something to work with. I really like this one. So I'm going to go with this one here because I like that I can change out the background. The emojis don't really vibe for me, but I do like the way this, the text font is laid out. So I'm going to click customize and then we're going to start working on this one right here. So the first thing that I see that I want to do is I want to remove this background and I'm going to take out these emojis. I don't really vibe with those. I'm, I'm kind of going for a more professional look here. So I'm just going to click on these and just delete them. looks like everything else is good. Um, one thing I'm, I'm seeing immediately, I'm probably going to want to change this text when I add my, my headshot here, as you can see, headshots are like pretty standard for podcasts. Uh, so if you're the host, you probably want to have your face. I already have some images uploaded here where I can use my headshot. So I'm just going to scroll to that. I like this one. So that's what I'm going to go with immediately. I see that the text is white. I'm sorry, is black and I probably want it to be white to pop more. So I'm going to go ahead and edit that really quick. I'm going to change the color of the text. And I do that by clicking on this little icon here and changing the color to white. Maybe an off white is probably better to go with. And so I'm going to do that to the top and I'm going to do that also with this as well. And now that I have my text and it's looking clean, you know, one thing that I'm noticing immediately that I do not like here is that I want to have, I don't want to have this border. It kind of looks strange. So I'm going to go ahead and pull my headshot image that I just added and stretch that out a little bit to where it takes up the entire canvas of the art. And then I'm going to grab the text here and I can move this around a little bit. It might make for a better experience. So I'm just going to move this a little bit so it's not blocking my face. And that looks good so far. So just probably going to want to change this to my name. So you just go here with Vernon. And then the other thing I, I noticed immediately is that like there's no separation between the background and my face, the text in my face here. So I'm going to add a design element and I'm going to add a shape. I'm going to add a, a square. You can see all the shapes here. So I'm going to add a square to kind of set behind this text. And I want to bring maybe this down a little bit and maybe I want to kind of change this font to a different kind of font to make it a little bit bigger. So if I wanted to choose maybe a different font, I can do that. Only other thing that I want to do is probably change the color of this square that I put back here. So I'm going to click on that and I'm going to change the color to something that I feel like pops more like a pink. So that pink pops really nice up against that blue. There we go. And now that's my podcast cover. I will be using this for my podcast. The next thing I want to do is hit share and hit download and make sure it's 3000 by 3000 pixels. It's PNG. I just simply click download and it'll download to my computer and then I can upload it to whatever podcast platform that I'm using. If you love this video, you're going to love the next one. It's going to be sharing how to edit YouTube shorts and Canva. So make sure you check out that video right there. If you have a VSL and you're looking for a way to create video easily for your VSL, you can check out that video there. Thank you for watching.